I've tested a lot of accessories for a living and these are the ones I personally use on a daily basis, the hat included. So let's check it out. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Starting off, we always got a sling bag, then whatever's in the pocket, but more importantly, there's always some clipped on the waist like Batman. Ever since I found this, I've worn this probably every day because doorknobs. Now this one is a little beaten up, but you can tell I do use it every single day. It's a little worn out here. It's cracking there and I've already broken this once. This clip is pretty fragile, but honestly for 10, 15 bucks, worth it. It holds about a week's worth of sanitizer and it is vacuum sealed, so it doesn't need a straw and it will suck up every last bit that you put inside. And when filled, it does shoot out a pretty good load. Next up in the front pocket, I've always got two things. First is my keys and recently I switched to this, the KeySmart iPro. By now you probably get the drill. It's two screws and you put keys within it that allows you to flip it right out and get instant access. But what makes this one special is this. Because when you press it, it's a mini light. So when it comes time to finding the hole, this makes it a lot easier. But the best part, it's got Apple's tracker built right in. And finally, you know I had to accessorize it even more and I added this giant clip, which allows me to securely put it here so I know exactly where it is. The second thing reserved in the front pocket is this. My wallet of choice, the Distill Union Wally Micro. It's minimal, made of leather, and most importantly, has this. Well, bam allowing you to quickly access any of your cards, but then storing it away just as quick. It's held together with this elastic, which also allows you to store some extra cash on the outside, but is also double-sided and is only as thick as whatever you put inside. Next up on the other side, we always have the phone of choice, which is obviously the superior choice, the iPhone 14 Pro, but more importantly, wrapped around it, is this Alumu case paired with their MagSafe grip and stand. I featured this in a previous video and y'all seem to love it because honestly, it also doubles as a fidget toy as it ratchets really nicely. And, oh yeah. To top it off, it's even got a built-in butter knife. Yeah. It actually works. And as a stand, it works pretty well. But I heard y'all, and you're pretty interested in the case too. It's from the same company, Alumu, and yeah, it's pretty cool looking. Plus the MagSafe magnets they have built into the case is pretty strong. As a case though, they use this soft rubber finish, which is really nice to hold on to. Plus, it's got a decent lip around the front, so you don't have to worry about it. And the little details around the case, like the text and this metal ring around the camera, plus the graphics are top notch. Now the bag is pretty special though. It's a one of one prototype from Remote Equipment, which I had to buy off a Facebook member on their Facebook group, but no regrets because I freaking love it. So essentially it's a giant front pocket, but then there's a giant pocket on the inside, which is all waterproof. And more importantly, is large enough to hold my water bottle of choice. The new Rhino Shield bottle with built-in MagSafe. It holds about a liter of water, has a quick flip lid with a straw built in, which is optional, but more importantly, has this, flip it up, and you've got a built-in MagSafe phone stand with multiple angles. Great for when you're having lunch alone and can watch your favorite show. Plus, makes for a great phone tripod too for recording your favorite TikTok dances. 
The best part is it doesn't look cheap or gimmicky and it's actually a functional water bottle. Now where it really gets exciting is this front pocket. Made of this premium ripstop waterproof material, but also a aqua card zipper. Inside, I carry my daily essentials, quick access for everything that I need, like this, a donk treat dispenser. Now it is made of plastic, and while I love that it's lightweight, unfortunately, I already broke the clip off, but I still love it because of this. Because when you push this, a treat comes out. And for any dog owners, you know how useful this is. Now just imagine a clip here and how easy it is to access, but I will have to DIY my own solution so it doesn't break off again. Inside the rest of the bag, you gotta have mints and gum as well, but this one is special. The Quip gum dispenser, while you do have to use their own gum, it's like a Pez dispenser for gum. Plus, it comes in this sick all black finish. A fun one that I recently picked up is this Coke looking bottle with actual Coke branding, but pop it open and it's secretly a lighter, which it actually works. It's so cool. Lastly, obviously you gotta have the AirPods, but more importantly, this. It basically puts a door on your AirPods because if you've ever dropped one of these, you know the real struggle. Yeah, never lose them again, sort of. Small drops will be okay, anything larger than that. You're still shit out of luck. But still, if you tend to drop everything, something is better than nothing. And it barely adds any bulk too. Plus it's kind of cool to do. I talk about the bag more, but it is a prototype. Just know that remote equipment does some pretty cool stuff and that's it. This is what I take with me on a daily basis. And the coolest one is probably this. Just a neat party trick. So that's it. I rest my case. It's too small.